Okay, here's a problem where a stock currently pays no dividends, but at some point in the future, it is going to start paying dividends. And so we've got a little bit of structure here uh, as well. So what do we know? We know that its first dividend is going to be $4.02, and it's going to happen exactly seven years from now. And then it's going to be paying these dividends uh, over and over again forever. So it's going to be paying a perpetuity. And so putting this on a timeline, we have the following. We have nothing in the first six years, and then seven years from now, we've got 402, and then another 402, and that's going to be constant forever, 402. Okay, so we can immediately see then we're dealing with a perpetuity, right? So this is a perpetuity but it doesn't start until year seven. And so when we think about our present value of a perpetuity, it's gonna be a cash flow divided by a discount rate, but that cash flow um, needs to occur one period after uh, the period in which you're calculating the present value. And so since the first cash flow happens in year seven, this is gonna be a PV at time six. And so any calculations we do in our initial step are gonna get us to time six. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that first calculation. And so we can say that the price at time six is going to equal 402 divided by the point 073. And that price is 55.0685. So some extra decimals to eliminate some rounding problems. Okay, so this is not the answer. This is uh, instead uh, a price at this point in time. So it's the expected price at time six. And so what can we do now? Well, we can rewrite this timeline. So we can put a 55.0685 right here at time six and get rid of all of those dividends, right? Because we've already, we, we, we subbed in the present value um, at time six for all those future dividends. And so now we can find the price at time zero by simply bringing that back or discounting it six periods. And so the answer here, P zero is $55.0685 divided by 1.073 raised to the what power? raised to the sixth hour.